Hi fellows, how are you? Today uh, I will continue to my uh, uh, getting started with uh, Google Cloud Platform. So previously I have uh, created a video where you can uh, set up your Google Cloud using a virtual instance and also an SQL Server. If you don't know how to do this, you can check my other videos. I will give the previous video description. So in this video, I will show you how you can secure your uh, WordPress by using uh, a SSL certificate from Let's Encrypt and let's uh, make those sites as a HTTPS element. So I have previously uh, set up a WordPress here, WordPress.SiteCenture.com. It's on Google Cloud Platform, GCP WordPress. Then uh, now I'm going to install Let's Encrypt and we'll set up SSL certificate over there. So let's get started. In Google Cloud Platform, you can easily connect to SSH in uh, from the browsers. That's pretty easy. You just connect over there. And then I'm going to uh, just go for some comments here. Cert bot one two. I actually don't remember those uh, comments. I just copy this from the site. It's you don't you don't actually need to do this because you have, it's not necessary. These comments change every day, and why you should fill up your memory with these useless comments, which is available in internet in one second. Here I am. Um, Tata, I will just run those commands on my terminal and let's do this. Okay, it's on uh, Ubuntu 18.4. Let's paste some commands here. Okay, okay. La, la, la. It's running. It's running. Mm -hmm. okay okay great so it is now done all those commands has been done i will give you those comments in the, in the description box so don't worry about this then install start bot start bot is a bot which is actually requesting a certificate from this let's encrypt server and installs on your server so it's basically does a lot of things on the background. You just don't need to do remember all those things which we were previously doing in old days. Okay, let's see how far we go over there. Okay, shutter bot has been uh, installed. Then I'm going to. Uh, issue a certificate and let's do this let's get this done okay my email address is at yandex .com. right okay uh, let's agree yes 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 baby yes there is no need no names were found that's true i haven't set up any virtual host because it's pointing to the default directory why you should need to set up okay but they want to know the domain name so let's give it Tan -ta -ta. they are now going to verify this domain which points to the server and they are going to put some files over there for verifications and voila it has been done so now it asks me whether i want to redirect that's awesome previously i had to manually do this by searching those commands and putting those into virtual host but now it's doing by himself that's crazy let's do this point two redirect and it's done just restart the server so service apache 2 restart 
ta 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 and if I now browse here it will redirect me to HTTPS oh boy yes it does but still it shows bad why because there are some links are still pointing to the HTTP site so how to solve this there is some way to solve it which is we just modify the wp config file so oops just a moment okay i'm going to uh, search for how to put base url in wp config file <laughs> These are the things that I know, but I just don't uh, remember. Okay, here are these two files. Two lines I just copy. Then I go to WP config. Okay, let's try to save it. It has been saved. Then I'm going to refresh. Yes, it is now pointing everything to HTTPS. And if I go here, its site is secure and certificate is valid for three months, September 28 to Friday, December 27. Cool. So that's it. This is. This is pretty easy and I think you should all easily secure our website using Let's Okay and I have just shown you on uh, Google Cloud Platform. Thank you for watching my video and now go play.